Hello everyone to Abhirishi channel. Today I'll be doing a book review of a book which I've been using for the last three or four years. Uh, this is a book written by Barton Zwieback, and it's a first course in string theory. Uh, this book is really useful if you want to know about uh, what all uh, is the mathematics and the history of string theory and its development. So just a quick note: string theory is like around a 50-year-old theory. It tries to combine the formalisms and the mathematics of quantum mechanics with the formalisms of the uh, recent uh, theory of uh, gravitational forces and uh, the space-time. So uh, this uh, string theory, uh, like in this, there are some uh, examples of uh, various cases of strings, like bosonic, fermionic strings, relativistic strings. Then various space times like AD, ADS CFT, which is entity sweater space, conformal uh, field theory, and so on. So this book is uh, uh, it's not uh, it requires a lot of prior knowledge. So the prior knowledge can be you should be knowing a bit of relativistic mechanics and a bit of linear algebra and uh, a bit about uh, quantum mechanics, a little bit about topology and so on, whatever is required for string theory. Uh, so let me just go through uh, what exactly you should be expecting in this book. So there will be various derivations uh, of various uh, test scenarios. So like uh, let's take some uh, scenarios like the, the case of string parameterization or light cone relativistic strings or uh, relativistic super strings or uh, some few more uh, like strong interactions in ADS CFT covariant string quantization uh, loop amplitudes in string theory maybe uh, also comparing the string theory with l quantum loop uh, gravity which was which is another different formalism but somehow people are uh, there is less uh, people developing it uh, there are more people developing string theory right now so yeah this book is really useful if you want to just get the hang of string theory and uh, uh, this is the kind of the recent physics that has been happening for the last 50 years uh, like even you need to know a little bit about particle physics because right now uh, there are a lot of experimentalists out there uh, who are just trying to study particle physics and whether uh, finding ways to uh, unify or verify certain uh, observations that they have. So yeah, uh, this book is really uh, useful. Uh, in the future, in this channel, I'll be making detailed uh, examples. I'll be taking some test cases and trying to be explaining. Uh, till then, stay tuned and uh, keep studying mathematics and topology and all all the mathematical jargon that exists thank you